Hi everyone! Well, I'm headed into Thrift USA to see if they have anything. I came here as my second stop today. Usually I come here as my first stop, but we'll go in and check it out and see if they have anything new. So here we go. Okay, we're going to start in the Christmas section because I found a little gobel lamb here. And uh, it's been a few, probably a month and a half since I found it. And what I didn't realize at the time, I hadn't looked it up yet, that the lamb alone is worth like $30. So I, want, I, I looked for the rest of the nativity set, but I didn't know what it looked like. Now I know what it looks like, so I'm going to see if there's any more pieces. But anyway, um, it's kind of a really tight area and there's people over here, so I don't know if I can get through. So here we go. There is a donkey specifically that I'm looking for, and the whole set sells for like $400 if you have the whole set. And there is the house, the little manger part. I'm gonna look for that. It's it's um, Gobel and Hummel is how it kept being advertised, but the little lamb doesn't say Hummel on the bottom. He just says Gobel. Her daddy has uh, another baby outside the family. Okay, not seeing anything like that in here. Hi. Okay. Sorry. No, you're fine. Thank you, man. Well, these are pretty. Okay, let's head into the, I guess they call it the antique room. Oh, look at that coat up there. I'm not into animal furs, but it's probably, it's got tags on it. It's really cute. It's probably faux. I'm not sure. It's way too high for me to get down. I don't think they have one of those things that you can get it down. Anyway, okay, let's start over here. Well, here's one of these big, big, big butter slabs. Germany, they want $19 for it though. I think that's too high. Okay, let's see what else they've put out. Some kind of stein. What is this? Glass set. This is probably Linux, but yeah, this stuff just... I mean, they're probably $19.99, yeah. It's just not... They just overpriced the Linux. It doesn't really do that well. If someone was buying it for themselves, no, that's a different story, but not for resale. Okay, I don't see anything there. Oh, well, there's that beautiful vase. I don't think anyone's ever going to buy it. Man, I didn't want $14.99 for it, and it's broken. Okay, I don't see too much there. This is really, really cute. 99 mahogany. Look how beautiful that is. I don't know what name that is. Look how pretty it is. It's kind of messed up up here. It's really nice. Let's look at this bookcase over here. Oh, that is really cute. How much is that? $89.99. Let's see. I think it's the same company. And you don't have a whole... Oh, the shelves do move. It's 
really cute. I have to think about that. I think that's broken right there because this side's not like that. I like that a lot. God knows I need a bookcase, but yeah, I don't know. Hmm. It's pretty. Rich glass. This is really pretty. Four ninety nine. Hmm. It just reminds me of the Italian kind of in poly glass. Okay, I'm gonna put that in my cart for right now. Look at the decanter. Let's look at that too. Okay, I'm going to put this on um, pause for a moment. Okay, so there were too many people over here a minute ago, but nothing really new in the cases except for one thing. This vase up here, which they want $400 for. No idea what it is. And we're not even going to ask to see it. Look at that. $4.99 for those, those two goblets. Like, oh, I guess that one's part of it, too. I don't see anything else in here. You know, these... There's that perfume bottle back there, but the, it used to have a stopper. It's disappeared. I think probably someone dropped it and broke it. The hobnail lamp, fairy lamp top is interesting. But, yeah, they've been here for a while. Okay. That is, I saw that last time. I have no idea what that is. It almost looks like turquoise is inlaid in there, but I doubt it. And who knows, they probably want a fortune for that as well. Okay. I want to see how much they want on that. Look at that carving in the back of it. I just don't see the price. Okay, we'll ask them about that. Okay, in the meantime, let's come over here. Dolls, we're not doing dolls. That beautiful cup is still here. It's really pretty. Oh, there's the Wedgwood for $19.99. What is this? This is a cute set. No top to the teapot. Okay, we're gonna look. Let's look at this real quick. $19.99. Wonder if this is anything. It looks old. 
The iron, the red, is not bright. No sticker on the bottom, but I don't know. It could have had Made in China sticker on it before. Oh, you can tell the remnants of a label. So we're going to put that up. Some kind of sticky label on that. Okay. This one. Yeah. No. Okay, for the fun of it, I am going to ask them to see that vase. We'll see what it is. What is this? Goldman. Wait. Goldamari. Oops. I'm going to break it. Something wear. Slipwear. $14.99. It's cute. I'll put it in my basket and I'll look it up. Okay. Okay. Let's look in here. Now, um, I walked away from the antique room and I heard an announcement that someone wanted to look at one of the cases. And so I ran back in there and I looked at that vase that they want 400 for. And it's Satava, Satava, made out of Chico, California. I actually held it. It is gorgeous. But on eBay, um, they make a lot of stuff with jellyfish designs and stuff in it. They sell for about mm, high 200. So I feel like right now it's just w priced way too high. And as soon as they come down on the prize, I'm sure someone will grab it. It's a great, great vase if someone's just buying it for themselves. Now what I did get is this. I don't know, I'm gonna, look at this frame. This frame is gorgeous and it's old. They want 119 for this. It says, it's a, it's a photo, but it's a print. It says a yacht in 1895 at full sale or something. But look how old this frame is. Alone. I think it's old. I don't know. I'm thinking about it right now. But it's gorgeous. Even the photo is gorgeous. If you can see that sideways. And that's where we are right now. So I did get a vase out of that um, cabinet. Which I don't know. It looks Native American. And I'm thinking about that. I had them take it up front. Uh, it had like two spouts on it. And then it had, um, I don't know if you remember, it looks Native American. Has a name on the bottom. So I'm gonna look that up here shortly and decide if I'm gonna get it. But for now they have it up front. But I'm not seeing too much more here. Now I'm gonna go where the vases are. Of course the music's loud over there. So I'm gonna head that way right now. Okay, let's look over here. I'm not seeing anything. Kind of scoped it out before I turn the camera on. I don't really have anything over here. And of course there's music playing that I'm probably gonna have to do a voiceover. That frog, what is the frog? He's cute, but I'm down here. Those look like Linux. Yeah. Not sure what these are. Okay, let's look over here at the vases. Like I said, sometimes I have luck over here. This looks like a Linux. What is that? It's weird. Party light. I like the glaze on that. That's really pretty, but no name. I 
It's definitely new. Okay, we're gonna go one other area. And then I think we're at, oh, oh my God, here's two more of these. Okay, why do they keep pricing? Is it me? Are these just really not what I think they are? Look at all those bugs in there. Okay, we're gonna put this one down. Oh, they look like Bristol vases. Sorry, I might have made y'all sick there for a second. I got one here the other day. What do y'all think? Am I just getting very lightweight glass? I know Bristol's usually blue. Let's see if we can, oh. Mm. Okay. Just reminds me of the vase that's in the antique room. Okay, I'm gonna put that like that. What else is up there? I don't see anything else. Okay. Okay. I looked at these already. This one's got a big chip on it. There. These are broken off. This one doesn't really look broken, but I'm not sure. Mats and hand painted. Okay, music's down for right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna hang on to this one for a second and look it up, and then I'll decide if I'm gonna come back for the other two. But they're broken. Okay. Cindy Lopper, okay. Let's see what we can see over here. Not really seeing anything over here. Put this down, look my basket back there. I don't know. It does say made in Japan, but I think it'd be hard to describe. Okay. Just gonna walk down here, leave my basket down there for a minute. Hopefully not in anyone's way. Okay, I'm not seeing much. Not much in the lamp area either. Okay. Okay, I just... So I pulled up this decanter earlier, and I didn't get a chance to look at it. It's just stupid on the bottom. So it's really light. Oh, let me break the stopper. I don't know if you can see it. It's right there. So it's got a number six or something. And Steuben. So that's $14.99. That's coming home with me. Um, I'm going to get these two vases. And probably this picture, I love the frame, and the, the photo's fine, too. But really, the frame is what I'm paying for. And there is a Navajo, I guess it's called a wedding base. Whoops, up front. And I looked it up, and they want 24 for it, and it sells for 19. And I even looked up the artist. Now, this is the vase that they want 400 for. And it is just gorgeous, like when you hold it. But it sells for like two fifty something, three. I found one very similar to it. So it's Chico, California, is where it's made. It's uh, I think the name is S A T A V A. Satava. If you want to look it up. They have a lot of stuff with jellyfish on it and stuff like that. So they're asking a lot of money for that. That's kind of cute. That's the Linux. Santa's Voyage. Okay, I think that wraps it up for me here. Um, the um, wedding vase, the Navajo one, it's horsehair pottery. 
Um, a couple was in here telling me that, and when I looked it up, it did say that on eBay. So, anyway, I think that wraps it up for here. I don't really see anything else. Okay. Okay, so I just finished up at Thrift USA, and I spent a total of $150, and most of that was for the framed photo. Um, it was a ship from $18.95, it said on it, but I really, really like the frame. That's why I got it. Um, other than that, I got the two Bristol vases, and um, I think that was about it. So, anyway, um, hope you like this video, and I will see you soon.